Let's look at how to get a Hobie 14 from the lake beach to out on the water and sail. Hi, it's Joe here from Joyrider TV and you're watching Gear Report. <laughs> Thanks, Joe. Hey, we gotta put the sail up. With the mast raised and boom in the slot, attach the head of your sail to the halyard and start hoisting. If the wind blows the sail to either side, it will bind and make it a lot harder to raise. Turn your boat into the wind so that the sail blows straight aft. One person can raise the sail, but it's easier if one person guides the sail into the slot on the mast while the other pulls the halyard. It may be a bit harder to pull when the little metal sleeve on the halyard passes through the sheath block at the top of the mast. But you have to get the sleeve through so you can hook it under the prong halyard catch. Then cleat the halyard. You also pull the running end of the halyard under the aft mast cleat, then up and through the hole in the bottom of the boom gooseneck or downhaul and back to the cleat. Stow any loose halyard in the trampoline pocket. Then connect your main sheet blocks and make sure your main sheet is untangled. Then you are ready to walk the boat out deep enough to put your rudders down. You can push off and do this while sailing, but it's easier on the rudder mechanisms to lower them and lock them in the down position by hand. We show the crew boarding first, then the helm. You can do it either way, but if launching from shore, then it will be shallower at the aft end of the boat, so easier for the helm to hop on last. Once you've gotten far enough from the beach that you won't be blown back into the shoreline, turn into the wind and loosen your main sheet to stop the boat. Then tighten your downhaul and power up your sail. Chances are you're smarter than me and won't be in the habit of leaving your mast step pin in place when you launch your Hobie. But if you did, then pull it out before you get into high winds and something breaks. Once all of the housekeeping adjustments are done, you are ready to sail. Move around on the trampoline as needed to keep the boat as level as possible, both forward and aft and from port to starboard. Use the telltales on your mainsail to guide you in making course changes. While underway, keep the tiller extension over your aft shoulder. That will keep it from getting snagged on the trampoline, clothing, or your life jacket. If your dock lines or riding line drag in the water, then secure them up out of the water. With your Hobie Cat set up properly and tidy, you are ready to enjoy some time on the water. No Sea Scouts were harmed in the making of this video. I promise. If you'd like to see how to step the mast on a Hobie 14 and get it from the trailer to the beach, let us know in the comments. I'll put a link in the description so you can check out our Hobie Cat sailing guide at gear-report.com. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe and click the notification bell so that you will be notified whenever we post new content.